I know, this webinar gathers top AI leaders from tech giants and large corporations such as like uh, Google, IBM, Microsoft, and uh, many other large corporations who have the best practice of AI across different industries. So um, as we are the biggest uh, corporation for IT services in uh, Vietnam and in Southeast Asia, um, I really want to sh uh, share not only our aspiration to be a world-class AI center in Vietnam and enhance our AI capabilities and talents, but also um, my plan to deliver uh, the state-of-the-art AI solution to address specific problems uh, of the um, most prominent industries right now. So currently we are bringing um, and building AI power uh, inspection product that helps factory to detect uh, defect product uh, automatically and efficiently. So okay. by joining this webinar, we would have the chance to hear from the top companies all over the world and about their challenge, about their practices in applying AI to every part of their working and production assesses. So I'm looking forward to participate in this uh, webinar. Sure. So, uh, yes. Um, so my name is Fong. I, uh, I am currently the Chief Artificial Intelligence Officer at FPT Software. Uh, in my company, we have around 20,000 engineers. And uh, uh, it's a very new title for uh, in the C-level uh, C-suite, uh, including uh, Chief Artificial Intelligence Officer. Um, so my job is to uh, develop uh, AI capabilities and strategy for the organization, um, building the uh, research and uh, development lab, as well as the solutions uh, department to provide the state-of-the-art AI. Um, before I joined uh, FPT, uh, I was a researcher uh, at Hitachi Research Lab and uh, also a visiting researcher in Mila. Uh, Mila is the, uh, one of the top AI Institute uh, research lab in the world, uh, led by, uh, leading by Professor Joshua Banjo, one of the Turing Award winner for his contribution in AI. And I got my master's degree from Carnegie Mellon University and my PhD from uh, the University of Tokyo in Japan. Yeah, so that's my, the summary of my uh, background. Well, the topic I am uh, sharing in this uh, webinar uh, would, would be data-centric AI. Uh, the latest update and also the practical, the practice uh, we apply it. So AI and ML uh, will be essential software for business and enterprise. Um, however, uh, not many organizations can harvest the power of it. Uh, they fail to build it. We realize that because we have served uh, thousands of clients. Because to build a, a practical AI, enterprises need to take a, a different perspective uh, from uh, academia. Uh, focusing on the data-centric AI instead of uh, model-centric AI. So data-centric AI will help uh, companies to uh, overcome challenges uh, while uh, building machine learning and AI practice such as uh, for example, some of the challenges are limited data, noisy data, and low quality data. So data-centric AI uh, would uh, leap the enterprise uh, to overcome all of these challenges. So while um, the technology of AI is super complex, so not every every organization can fully ready to absorb this technology. Even uh, at FPT Software, um, we cannot do it alone. So we made the decision to create a strategic partnership uh, to help us with the international and very fast evolution of AI. 
So uh, our two key areas that we have partnership are in research and in uh, business. So in research, we have partnered with uh, Mila, I just mentioned in the previous questions. Uh, Mila is a Quebec-based research institute in Canada. Um, in we, we re doing research with them in an attempt to uh, enhance our AI expertise and capabilities. Okay. And yeah, uh, Mila, uh, so APT is the first company in Southeast Asia to enter Mila Partner Network. Nice. Uh, joining the big uh, companies, for example, like Google and Microsoft and Facebook, which are already the existing um, partners. And with the partnership of Mila, we expect to deliver uh, many more uh, real-world AI applications, um, such as uh, those in nature language processing, smart factories, healthcare, agriculture, and even the topics like AI ethics. Uh, very important to us. Well, the global standard in that is is very uh, very very high, and uh, in and because um, you know we talk about MI for uh, AI and ML for the past you know a decade, yeah. for a decade already. So. Uh, in in that it, it has been developed and become a, a, a lot uh, become a very important standard. Um, so uh, at FPD Software, we uh, we are learning and updating every day uh, to get closer to achieve um, this, this the standard this standard. Uh, learning and absorbing the best practice are our strength. So uh, yeah. So since I joined APT Software, I, uh, like I mentioned, I succeeded in opening uh, an AI research lab uh, within the organization. Before, we don't have that. But the research lab uh, can help us provide uh, up-to-date research and state-of-the-art AI. Yeah, I would like to be uh, humble. <laughs> we have to be. Uh, we have to. Uh, we have an ambition uh, to be the top AI uh, lab and the AI solution provider in the world. And given that goal, we are. We have to learn and we have to update ourselves every day. So, given the lab and given the partnership, uh, we are uh, trying to uh, catch up with the standard and um, on the other on, on, on research side we partner with uh, le, uh, with Mila but on the business side we partner with uh, Landing AI a company um, built by Professor Andrew Ng Andrew Ng um, he's, he's the founder of Coursera the founder of Google Brain and he's currently leading uh, Landing AI. So Landing AI uh, is, is a very good company that uh, uh, building machine learning operations for computer vision. And we are learning a lot and we're partnering, partnering with them and building solution together. So um, given that uh, we, we are uh, trying to uh, learn a lot from the top you know people in the in the world of ai and we can, we can keep continue learning to uh, uh, stay uh, a, a very high standard and because the standard is always uh, being higher and higher and uh, we need to keep ourselves with that uh, explainable ai um, helps uh, the user to understand and uh, to trust the decisions of uh, the AI motor, right? Um, because in the uh, in in most of the times, uh, an AI motor is built uh, with a very uh, complex and um, uh, decision making, and it's it's impossible for users to understand it. So we usually call black box AI. Yeah. Um, Sometimes we, when 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 we build a motor and it's su surprisingly accurate, and human really want to understand what is the reasoning, what is the logic uh, when the the motor making decision, 
So Explainable AI helps us to unbox the black box. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and uh, it, uh, it helps for many uh, knowledge discovery. Some of the example uh, I can give is in, in our company, we build a very complex motor to uh, understand our employee happiness. Uh, we can measure the happiness level and we can uh, understand whether the company is happy to work or they are about to leave the company. So even only that information is not enough. We, have to, we also use explainable AI in order to understand the reason, what kind of feature, what kind of uh, properties that uh, lead to the uh, high happiness or low happiness. And given that information, we can improve the strength of, uh, uh, of our company. So improve uh, the factor that uh, gives the employee high happiness level and try to reduce the factor that uh, make the employee unhappy and uh, make that uh, to, uh, lower and, and, and less uh, severe so that uh, the company uh, will retain the talents uh, longer. So that is one of the examples of how we use XAI or explainable AI uh, to discover new knowledge. In it, we are focusing on some key AI technologies uh, that I really hope that it may become a game changer uh, for our business. So we are the largest IT service, IT provider. Uh, so we help our customer to do the heavy lifting uh, by writing software for them, writing uh, a lot of software application and system for them. So uh, we invest in AI for software or uh, another word, AI for code. Um, it is one of our key strategies to enable uh, the productivity to skyrocket. Uh, AI can help our developers to write code more efficiently, make fewer mistakes, uh, resulting in fewer bugs and uh, improvement, improving productivity. Um, on another hand, like I mentioned, explainable AI is also among our uh, top investment as its key technology will enable our customer to believe in how AI can make decisions and improve transparency. And finally, uh, we follow the data-centric AI and the best practice in ML ops uh, to provide us to building the practical and reliable AI solutions. So that's the three key pillars we I have the, for the strategy in AI for our company. Um, well, uh, I really uh, excited to join this webinar and uh, AI is such a powerful uh, weapon <laughs> or uh, such a powerful uh, tool. So uh, comes with the great power, it comes with uh, also responsibility. So I hope we can use AI for the, for the great did and uh, use that uh, properly and uh, make our life happier with AI.